What's up guys and welcome to The Modern Ninja and I love katanas. I mean, who really doesn't? They are great to train with and I just really love collecting them for decoration or show. Plus, who doesn't want a nice sturdy katana for when the zombies come? Am I right? But anyway, the hard truth is that a good katana is not cheap and for some katanas, they could run you 200, 300, even 600 dollars. I wasn't playing games, rent is too damn high. And if you really want to look for it, you can find a katana for even a thousand dollars. Now, as your friendly neighborhood ninja, I don't have that kind of money to just be dropping on designer swords like that. I wish I did, but uh, I'm broke. And I'm sure many of you are in the same boat as me. So that's why I'm going to go over the top five, or at least <laughs> some of the best five swords that you can get for somewhere around $100. Now I should say $100 is not much for a sword, but there is no reason a beginner or someone just looking for a decorative piece should have to drop more than that on their blade, or at least on their first blade. So that is who this is going to be aimed for, people who just want their first blade or want to decorate their house. But anyone who wants a sword can definitely check out this video and get some, you know, cool weapons from this. Obviously, all links down below, but let's begin with number five, the Handmade Dragon Samurai Katana. One of the great things about this bad boy is that it comes in over 20 different designs and colors, allowing you to pick and choose whatever suits your style best. Red, blue, white, yellow, flowers, green leaves, and a ton of other options for whatever aesthetic you need. And as a bonus, it's functional. Even though it's technically not designed for combat, the fact that it is full tang means that it can hold up fairly well and shouldn't just snap on you when you decide to swing it. For those that don't know, full tang means that the blade material extends all the way through the handle. So the metal through, is through the handle and the handle is wrapped around it. And for all you metal guys out there, it's made out of a 1045 high carbon steel, making it strong, durable, and hard. Now this won't be sharp out of the box like many swords you buy online are, but it should be able to retain an edge if you give it one down the line. Number four, the handmade Japanese Samurai Katana. I'm just gonna say this now, I didn't name these, so don't blame me if they sound uh, a little on the nose. Now this one again is gonna be both affordable and functional. Again, being forged out of that 1045 steel we talked about before, and being clay tempered, which allows for better impact resistance and overall durability. And of course, you can't be functional without also being a full tang blade, so that goes without saying, but the handle is quite long, measuring at about 10.5 inches, and the wood is wrapped in ray skin and cotton cord, providing an ergonomic grip that is also quite durable. Number three is Vulcan Gear Classic Handmade Katana. Vulcan Gear is a well-known brand name that makes tons of different weapons and tools. Switch blades, pocket knives, broadswords, and much more all coming from these awesome guys. These katanas are handcrafted and focused on being high quality. This 40 inch sword is made of carbon steel and of course features a full tang design. And for the price, this tuba style sword is quite hard and durable. And like I said before, this doesn't come sharp out of the box. So make sure you order some sharpening kit or add some tools into your cart so that you can sharpen it after you receive it. However, this does actually come with a wooden stand. So making it your centerpiece is much easier if you want to go the decoration route. Number two is the Swood Handmade Sharp Katana Sword. Like I said before, I didn't name these, so if they're on the nose, it is what it is. But this sword comes with some really cool color and design options, starting with a traditional black, a nice deep blue, and even a bright orange that really does pop. So again, any of you trying to find a sword that fits a specific aesthetic, this would be perfect for you. This blade is going to be a little bit different than the previous blades though. It's going to be made out of a 1060 high carbon steel. This type of steel is known for its excellent durability, hardness, and impact resistance. Meaning it will hold up to strikes and won't shatter on impact, which is, you know, kind of important in a sword. But even if it did actually somehow break, it comes with a complete two year warranty, which for the price is kind of surprising. And of course it comes with a full tang design as well. I think you should know by now, I wouldn't put a half tang sword in my video. 
I wouldn't want to do that to you. But this sword is 100% handcrafted and hand forged, so it didn't go through any automated systems or machines, and like it says in the name, it actually comes sharpened. So as great and convenient as that may be, you need to practice caution. Using this sword as a centerpiece may be an issue if little Johnny gets his hands on it and cuts his fingers off. No one wants that. And number one being Ace Martial Arts Supply Handmade Japanese Shirashaya Samurai Katana. That was a mouthful and I'm not sure I said that right, but here we go. It comes in three different colors to choose from. A nice polished black, a wood stained red, and a traditional wood finish. This blade is actually going to be a pretty high quality level though, especially for the price. It is 100% handmade with of course a full tang design. Now, I do not know what material this sword is made of, and so because of that, I'd probably just use it for decoration as opposed to any type of martial arts practice. And of course, I do want to give a great big shout out for the guys at Japanese Knife Reviews. They did a great job over there, and I wouldn't have been able to put this video together without their help. And I will leave a link to their site down below. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed the channel, and if you do, make sure you give me that HBO special the help a brother out special so all you got to do is help brother out hit the like leave a comment and subscribe if you want to see more but until next time my name's dj moore this is the modern ninja and i'm out